We are all incredibly disturbed to see the news coming out of the United States last night that their Supreme Court is poised to overturn Roe v. Wade and remove the legal right for a woman to seek an abortion. For one of the world's largest democracies to roll back women's rights by two generations would have ripple effects throughout the world. This would embolden those who seek to roll back our rights in Canada. Women's autonomy over our own bodies is being threatened. I know many people in Alberta may have taken for granted that abortion services are a regular part of the public health care system. And that is exactly as it should be. Under an Alberta NDP government, women's reproductive services will always be publicly insured health care. While access to abortion is currently decriminalized in Canada, there are still barriers to services and supports. There is currently a bill before the House allowing bereavement leave for pregnancy loss, but this bill only provides leave when a woman has a miscarriage or stillbirth. It discriminates in terms of the kinds of pregnancy loss a woman experiences. This bill must define pregnancy loss to include abortion and termination for medical reasons. We will be putting forth amendments in the House to make these changes to the bill and we will see how the UCP votes. I know that many Albertans are concerned over this news and what it will mean for us here in our province. I am one of them, as are my colleagues, all of them. The landmark decision that legalized abortion in the U.S. in 1973 was a victory for all women. But we know that, that those who seek to roll back women's right, those who seek to reinstate discrimination against women, have never rested. This recent news is yet more evidence that the fight for equality may truly never be over. It's a stark reminder that elections have consequences and that our most basic right to control our own bodies is still under threat. As reproductive freedoms are being eroded in the United States, Canadian politicians at all levels of government must declare their unwavering support for a woman's right to choose. I give Albertans my categorical guarantee that an NDP government will do everything we can to protect, to protect reproductive rights here in Alberta and frankly across this country.